everyone. My reading today, or my read aloud today, from my friend's library is this book right here. It says, Strictly No Elephants. And strictly means absolutely not. Or there might be consequences, something might happen. Or um, it just means that you cannot break the rules. It is strictly no elephants inside this door. Hmm. So I wonder, we can't see the front of this animal right here. What animal do you think it is? Knowing the title, what animal do you think it might be? An elephant. Right. That's, that's my thinking too. We'll have to see. Strictly no elephant. Oh, I noticed something else about the boy and the elephant. Do you see something similar between the two? They're both wearing a red scarf. Ooh, I wonder if we'll find out more about that in a little bit. This book is written by Lisa um, Manch Mantichev, illustrated by Ta Tainun Yu. Tainun Yu. I think that's Tainun Yu. Okay. Strictly no elephants. Oh, there we can see the front of him. We can see his long, what is this called? Trunk, right, we can see his trunk. That helps us know it's an elephant. The trouble with having a tiny elephant for a pet is that you never quite fit in. Do you think that it would be a new sight for you if you saw somebody walking around with an elephant? Right, you don't see that very often or ever. Maybe at the zoo, but you don't see an elephant as a pet. Hmm. No one else has an elephant. Ooh, we see some pets in the windows. We see, what is this pet? A bird, right? And a cat and a fish and looks like two dogs, another dog. Does anybody else have an elephant? No, right, he's the only one. Every day I take my elephant for a walk. He is a very thoughtful sort of, or he, his is a very thoughtful sort of walk. Oh, we see the little boy is doing, what is he doing in this picture? Right, holding the umbrella. And this picture, the elephant is holding the umbrella. He's being very thoughtful. He's thinking about his owner or his friend being very nice and thoughtful to hold the umbrella. He doesn't like the cracks in the sidewalk, oh, in the sidewalk much. Let's see, there's the crack in our sidewalk. I always go back and help him over. That's what friends do. Lift each other over the cracks. I do not know if I could lift a baby elephant. This, this little boy must be very strong. Even a little elephant, I still think weighs a lot. Today I'm walking my tiny elephant to number 17. It's pet club day and everyone will be there. Looks like everybody's taking their, what kind of animal? Their dogs, right? And he's taking his elephant. Do you think he's gonna fit in? I don't think anybody else is gonna have any elephants. Come along, there's a good boy. I coax him the last few feet. It'll be fine. Hmm. Seems like he's having a tough time getting him to walk there. How do you think the elephant is feeling about going to the club? You see here, he has to coax him or kind of get him, maybe give him treats or give him nice words, something to make him come. And then he has to carry him. How do you think he's feeling? Right, maybe nervous, maybe he has some butterflies in his stomach. When I look up, there's a sign on the door. Ooh, I wonder what the sign says. What do you think the sign says? 
Do you remember what the title is? Strictly no elephants. Well, that's not very nice. That's not including everyone. What if elephants would like to come in too? Hmm. My tiny elephant leads me back to the sidewalk, never minding the cracks. Oh. What do, what do we see the elephants doing right here? He's stepping on the cracks, right? Hmm, so maybe thinking about how he's feeling right now if he doesn't care about the cracks. That's what friends do. Brave the scary things for you. Hmm. How are there two characters looking on this page? Great, we see the elephant's eyes are closed and looking down. See, the boy has kind of a frown on his face. They're not feeling very included right now. Did you try to go to the pet club meeting too? The girl asks. Yes, I say, but they don't allow elephants. Oh, interesting. What animal is she holding in her lap? Do you recognize that animal? A skunk, right? Oh, do you think they let her skunk in? No, oh, so they aren't letting in animals that aren't like most animals. They're not letting in animals that don't look like their animals. That's very not very nice. The sign didn't mention skunks, the girl says. But they don't want us to play with them either. They don't know any better, I tell her. He doesn't stink, the girl adds. No, he doesn't, I agree. What if we start our own club? Oh, that would be amazing. I love that idea. Come along, I say, making certain that my tiny elephant follows me, because that's what friends do. Never leave anyone behind. So remembering, good friends, never leave anyone behind. I like that a lot. Oh, what are we seeing in this picture? Right. There's so many different animals. Do you think that these animals were let into the, the club that only had cats and dogs in it? No, probably not because they don't look like those animals. But do you think that they deserve to be able to go to the club too? Right. They're fun animals. They should be able to play and hang out with new friends. I like this idea though. They're going and making their own club. And they're accepting everyone. We can play here, one of our new friends say. All of us. We can all play together. So we paint our own sign. What do you think this sign says? Mm hmm. It says all are welcome. Strictly no strangers, no spoil sports. And they put a big X in it because they don't want those people there. But they're accepting all animals. My tiny elephant will give you uh, directions if you need them. Looks like a flat. Oh, interesting. What are you noticing down here? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Right, there's two dogs. Do you think that these animals and the, their owners are going to let them into their club or not let them into their club? Give me a thumbs up if you think they're going to let them in. Give me a thumbs up if you don't think they're going to let them in. Right. 
I'm kind of thinking that too. Let's find out. Because that's what friends do. You know, I don't see the. Oh, I do see them. They did let them in. Oh, love that book. And I love thinking about the idea that everyone is welcome. No matter what they look like, everyone should be included. No matter what they think or feel, everyone wants to be a part of something and wants to be loved and accepted. Okay, everyone. Thanks for listening to my story. I'll see you later or I'll see you tomorrow. One or the other. Bye.